Good morning. Good morning. And welcome to Renew, the daily devotion for you. I am James. And I'm Toro. And the topic of this morning's devotion is the purpose of faithfulness. And I read uh, from the book of Romans, chapter 11, verses 34 through 36. I read, For who have known the mind of the Lord, or who have been his counselor, or who have first given to him? And it shall be recompensed unto him again. For of him and through him and to him are all things. To whom be glory forever. Amen. Amen. Okay. It's easy to look at life and judge success based on results. Do you look any more fit after going to the gym? Do you have more money after working so hard? Are you in a higher position in the company than you were last year? Our world is focused on seeing tangible results. God's work, however, is measured by visible results. God doesn't judge us based on how many people will lead to Christ or how large our sphere of influence has grown. God has a different plan for every person. His purpose and measure of success is based on faithfulness. Sometimes we become discouraged in, li in faithful living. Things go wrong, we don't see results like we'd thought, and discouragement sets in. Yet, despite how quickly and slowly things progress in life, Realize that God's purpose for your life is being faithful, is being fulfilled as long as you're faithful to him. Charles Spurgeon commented on the Christian ministry by saying, the grand object of the Christian ministry is the glory of God, whether souls are converted or not. If Jesus Christ be faithfully preached, the minister has not labored in vain, for he is a sweet savor unto God, as well in them that perish as in them that are saved. God's purpose for your life is to live faithfully and obey his commands. No matter what results you may or may not see, you can have joy knowing that God's will is being done. Take heart in knowing that you're faithful, that as you faithfully follow God, you are fulfilling his purpose for your life. He knows what's best and will accomplish his will through you as you are faithful to him. Uh, the growth principle for today is success in God's will is measured by faithfulness to God's command. How true that we should really focus on being faithful to God. We should not judge ourselves by anybody else's yardstick, but we need to remain faithful to God. What a principle to take around today. That is so true. And may the Lord help us mm. to be just focused on being faithful yes. to um, His will for our lives as opposed to chasing after results or accomplishments. Yes. Let's pray. Dear Heavenly Father, we just want to thank you for this devotion that we just did based on the need to be faithful and the true meaning of success in your eyes and not in the world's eyes. Mm -hmm. Father, help us to be faithful. Help us to be able to follow your paths and everything you set forth for us. Mm -hmm. I pray that everyone listening this morning will be affected by this principle also and be guided by it. Mm -hmm. Thank you for everything you're doing in our lives and what you have planned for us. And I ask all this in your son's precious name. Amen. 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 Thank you for joining us and join us again for the next episode of Renew. Thank you. Have a great day. Bye-bye.